black NYC fragrance family. Now this video is a video to make, I don't know if about a statement, but I just see so many of these videos of before you buy or is this still worth it? Let me tell you something. I'm going to make a statement at the end of this video, but you're going to have to wait to the end of the video to hear what I'm going to say. And this is going out to all the reviewers that continually do these videos. Hate me, like me, I don't care. I just, I, I'm, I'm just going to have fun with this. Anyway, so let's start off with the first one here. Aqua de Joe Profumo. Is it still worth buying? Yes. Absolutely. And if you don't, I don't, if you don't think so, I don't know what to tell you. Aqua de Joe Profumo. Fresh incense fragrance that can be used for any occasion. And yes, it's still worth it. In case you were wondering. Dior Fahrenheit, released in 1988. Is it still worth it? Reformulations, who knows, whatever, this, that, whatever. Petrol vibe still there. Smells fantastic. Still a great fragrance. Yes, it's still worth it. Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mans. Infamous, famous, outstanding fragrance. Is it still worth it? Yes, it is. We don't need to hear about it. It's a great smelling fragrance. Does it last like the original? No. Does it smell like the original? Yes. Do we care if it's still worth it or not? No. Next one. Chanel Platinum Egoist. Now you know how I feel about this one. Is it still worth it? Absolutely. Why would I not buy this fragrance? I don't care if it got watered down 10 more times. I'm still going to buy it because I love the way it smells. I'll spray it on 100 times if I have to. I don't care about the reformulation. Next one. Dior Sauvage. EDT. Is it still worth it even though we have an eau de parfum in a parfum? You know what? Spray it on and ask the ladies. I'm pretty sure they'll tell you it's still worth it. Next one. Because of the new release. Versace Eros EDT. Now yes, we have flame and I have flame. And I know we just came out with an eau de parfum. And it's all the rage and everybody loves it. And they're going to tell you that this is not worth buying because we have the Eau de Parfum and it's better and lasts longer and this formulation got watered down. But guess what? It's cheap. It still smells good. And yes, it's still worth it. Dunhill Icon. Some people don't like the fragrance. People say it smells like grape soda. Me personally, smell the grape soda. And it's still worth it. Great value, great everyday scent, still worth it. And last, and certainly not least, I had to do it. Is it still worth it? Hell Yes, it's still worth it. Creed Mother Effin Aventus. Yes, it is still worth it. I don't care what batch. I don't care who's woodier, smokier, whatever. And I'm not going to waste a freaking $10 spray. Creed Aventus, still worth it. Now, what I'm going to say. If I see another before you buy video on your channel. Is it still worth it video on your channel and I happen to be subscribed to your channel? I am going to unsubscribe. Have a nice day. New viewers, thank you for stopping by. New subscribers, thank you for joining the NYC Fragrances family and my NYC Fragrance family. I hope you enjoyed this video. I had a little fun with it. But you know what? It gets to a point where some things get to be so monotonous, so ridiculous, that I'm getting tired of seeing them. People are mad at me for saying it. I'm saying it. I have a voice. I can say what I want. It's my channel. 
So, till the next time, remember, if you smell good, you feel good. Have a nice day. Thank you.